Right now we're working on the ice bridge. We're putting a ramp in so we can get up the far bank of the Tanana River. Sean Kelly from 354 Civil Engineering Squadron. I'm a supervisory equipment operator, but also foreman of range maintenance. Well, the ice bridge itself runs from South Cushman across the Tanana, and then we have about eight water crossings, which are considered ice bridging. But the winter trail itself is about 28 miles, will go all the way to Blair Lakes. Basically, the bridge part is across the Tanana River, Salt Jacket Slough, then we have about eight other water crossings. Probably the very beginning is the biggest challenge, just because we don't know what we have for ice. So it's a little sketchy going across there for the first time. This year we did pretty good. We had pretty much 14 to 18 inches all the way across. Eventually our goal is going to be end up with five feet of ice. Boy, we've been out here before and all the way down to 55, 50 below. The advantage is you make ice real quick. I mean, the water almost freezes instantly. The challenging part is keeping all the pumps and all the mechanical stuff running. And the other option is we can fly fuel in or whatever, but I mean, the cost would be exponentially higher than what it is right now. And then eventually they'll be hauling probably double tankers full of fuel out here across this bridge. Basically there is no impact. The water melts or the ice melts, it turns back into water and goes back down the river.